Hi there, Brandon Ahmad here, bringing you a video on inventory reservation. Let's talk about reserved inventory and what inventory reservation process is. Many companies require certain items from reserved inventory for specific orders on a daily basis. These products are reserved to ensure that the availability of the items during order entry is there. And in simple terms, the reserved inventory cannot be withdrawn for any other order. And this process is known as inventory reservation. In other words, no one can actually take the inventory. Creating inventory reserves is also an approach companies use to prepare for spoilage, theft, and other negative impacts on their inventories. So there we have it, a definition of inventory reservation process and what reserved inventory implies. Let's move on to why an inventory reserve is needed for an organization. The inventory of its raw materials, materials and processed, and finished products all form crucial aspects of inventory management for any product organization. If you forget to maintain adequate inventory levels, your company runs the risk of losing its ability to meet demands, convert its stock into cash on time, or plan for manufacturing. You can reserve inventory at different stages of the production process. The quantity can always be changed if needed, but if there is a larger reservation than what is available in stock, there will be a shortage. Of course, the shortage can be covered as soon as the items are available for delivery again. But why should you have an inventory reserve? Well, here's some benefits. First ordered, first delivered, which means that customers get their product orders at a first come, first serve basis. You avoid the shortage of items due to the long delivery time of the supplier. You can give priority delivery to certain customers and orders. You can mark certain items that have been delivered to specific customers through the serial or lot number and reserve those personalized or exclusive items in the same way. It also allows you to mark items that are produced for and fit specific orders through the production orders. So this process will save you a headache by keeping the inventory you need available ready for delivery. How the solution works and why it's the best option. So now that we've covered the basics, let's step into the inventory reservation process in Microsoft Dynamics 365. Microsoft Dynamics 365 includes order fulfillment modules that allow you to set up inventory reservations based on inventory on hand, planned receipts, and prior order commitments. This system calculates the available to promise quantities, ATP, and allocates them to incoming customer orders. Using Dynamics 365 will positively impact your customer service as it maintains the supply and demand matching constantly. You can set up reservations automatically or manually the automatic process. Whenever a new order line is created, you can automatically reserve inventory. This process applies in two situations. First, when automatic is selected in the reservation field on the general tab on the accounts receivable parameters form. Second, when you select automatic in the reservation field, setup tab on a specific orders order header. Now for the manual process, when it comes to individual orders, you can set up reservations manually by clicking on accounts receivable then Setup, and then Accounts Receivable Parameters. Go to the General Area in the Reservation field and select Manual. And that's it. That's how you have a reserved inventory. Now, there are three forms to specify settings. The Accounts Receivable Parameters form first. You can do this by automatically or manually reserving items. That's what it applies to. Second, the Item Model Group form. You can use this to set up reservation dates. And finally, the customer's form, if you want to set up the warehouse where the inventory is going to be reserved. In this way, you can control all the steps, dates, and quantities of your reserved inventory and protect your investment. Let's go over some of the advantages and disadvantages of maintaining a reserved inventory. So first, for the pros of inventory reservation. Quicker response time. You can easily and quickly fill all customer orders as soon as they come in without having to worry about waiting on shipping their order out. Customers can be lost if you can't ship an order quickly. Decreased risk of shortages. By keeping on hand stock, you can rest assured that you will not run out of a particular item and you have less to worry about even if a product is discontinued. Quick replenishment. By keeping a reserved inventory, you can work to make sure that your shelves are always full and that your store always has a neat and tidy appearance. Some of the cons of inventory reservation. Tying up cash flow. The more inventory you have on hand, the greater the business's capital is tied up. You will risk slowing down your business cash flow. Risk of inventory becoming obsolete. The value and quality 
of your product decreases the longer you keep it in stock. You have to make it a priority to sell your inventory while it's new and fresh. Higher storage cost. Excess inventory means extra space needed for storage. Extra space also means extra cost since you can include those extra costs in your price and have to include them in your price. That is why you should have a controlled reserved inventory guaranteeing that the items are not more than their demand and that they already have a buyer. In this video, you've gained a high level understanding of inventory reservation and even learned about how to apply it in an ERP system such as Dynamics 365. If you would like to learn more about how to supercharge your supply chain processes, please visit us at instructorbrandon.com. We offer a number of services that assist with supply chain processes, including performance tuning, reporting, data migrations, and training. Simply reach out to us at help at instructorbrandon.com and someone will be happy to get back to you. Brandon Ahmad and the Instructor Brandon team signing off and wishing you well.